There have been 1,228 flash flood incidents in the Klang Valley from the start of 2014 to the end of 2018, according to data from the Department of Irrigation and Drainage. Among them, there are several places that were hit more frequently than others. Klang, Petaling, Hululangat, Kuala Lumpur and Gomba are the worst hit areas with more than 1,107 incidents between them. Flash floods have long been a problem in the Klang Valley. Why is it still an issue? Statistics on the number and locations of floods are included in the DID's annual reports. Among the main factors that cause flash floods in Kuala Lumpur is a rapid pace of development, such as housing and highways that are poorly planned and controlled. This time lapse show Klang Valley's development from 1984 to 2018. Of the 543 locations in the Klang Valley that have been affected by flash floods, 186 have been hit repeatedly. These are the six most often hit areas. Jalan Sultan Yahya Petra, Kuala Lumpur. It is situated in a low-lying area and during heavy downpours, water occasionally overflows Sungai Bunos. Water levels can go up to between 300 mm to 500 mm during heavy rain, causing flash floods. Insufficient water pipes channeling water to the drainage system is another factor for floods along with rapid development in the area. Jalan Tun Razak, Kuala Lumpur The 9 km long Jalan Tun Razak spans across three rivers, namely Sungai Gomba, Sungai Bunus and Sungai Kelang. From 2014 to 2018, parts of the road have been flooded 11 times. Jalan Raja Chulan, Kuala Lumpur The stretch of Jalan Raja Chulan from Museum Telecom to the intersection near Ambang has been hit by flash floods 11 times from 2014 to 2018. Drainage in the area has failed to channel out all of the excess water when heavy rainfall hits for about 2 to 4 hours. Continued development has also impeded the flow of water in the area, contributing to floods. Sekolah Kebangsaan Tengku Ampuan Rahimah Klang Located 1.6 km from Sungai Klang, the school and its surrounding areas have been hit by flash floods 16 times from 2014 to 2018 due to the inability of the drainage system to channel excess rain during sudden heavy downpours. Kampung Melayu Subang, Shah Alam Kampung Melayu Subang has been hit by flood 17 times from 2014 to 2018 due to its close proximity to Sungai Damansara, which sometimes overflows during heavy downpours. The housing area along Jalan Jati was most affected, with 12 flood incidents between 2015 to 2018. Flood mitigation works in the area near Sungai Pelempas is in progress. Federal Highway The Federal Highway is the top location where flash floods regularly occur every year. The area most affected is along the highway's motorcycle lanes. Tunnels along the motorcycle lanes are usually located at low-lying areas and are often flooded, with 23 incidents between 2014 and 2018. Floods have hit the location over four times each year. However, in 2018, only one flood incident was reported. The DID annual report stated that flood mitigation plans are being carried out but called for better coordination between federal territories and the Selangor government.